Welcome back, guys, to Better Call Saul. Oh, I'm just kidding. That's actually what's on my TV right now. I don't know if that show is good or not, because, like, I have it on, and so, like it's, but the sound is muted, so I don't know. Anyway, in the last video, we came to this room, which actually is a familiar room. We came here before, earlier in the game. First time we came to Low Rules, this room. And it was our first impression, and it was not a good one. And we haven't seen much to change our minds since then. It's been nothing but monsters and shit and shit. So, you grab yourself some fairies on your way. But we're going to head on back because now, unlike before, there goes my dinner and there goes my din din. It's a very, oh, a very badly timed recording this was. So I didn't think I was going to get stuck in that room in the last recording. I got stuck in that room for like five minutes. It's like, yeah, five minutes would have made all the difference between you not having your din-din be ready. Your din-din, you know. So in case you haven't noticed, I have prepared for this battle extensively. And I am ready. Oh, hi, Hilda. What's up, babe? Wife, that shit. Man, that's so stupid! Why was I so stupid?! Wife, that shit. Just because you saw somebody using wife as a verb one day and you're like, Oh, that's cool! I'm gonna use that in my commentary! That's how stupid I am. Because everything I come up with is somebody else's idea. You know? Then again, pretty much everything you know, got you got from somewhere. There's nothing, no such thing as originality. Jeez, I didn't mean to get so mad at myself there. I just love getting mad at my past self, though. Even if it was like seven days ago. Especially when he's being stupid and saying life that shit. That shit's stupid. Why did I say that? Perhaps it's only fair that I share a story with you. One day a guy came up to me and he said, wife that shit. And you know what I said to him? I didn't say a thing. I just killed his ass. It's the legend of how low rule fell to its current condition. Oh no. Long ago, low rule possessed a sacred golden treasure. It could grant the wish of anyone who touched it. It was known as the Triforce in our world, as it is in yours. Many sought to control the Triforce, plunging Low Rule into endless war. The kingdom was on the verge of ruin. My ancestors got rid of the Triforce to stop the war by destroying it. Utterly and absolutely. Bad idea. It was done with good intentions, but it had disastrous consequences. The Triforce was the foundation of our world, and without it, our kingdom crumbled. Chaos has since reigned in, in low rule. In doe rule. We need a Triforce, so imagine my surprise when I learned of the existence of another one. Yours. A Triforce based on such virtues as power, wisdom, and courage. To that end, I have guided your destiny, Hero of High Rule. As the Princess of Low Rule, it is my duty to save my kingdom, so I know you'll understand it when I say. <clears throat> I MUST HAVE YOUR TRIFORCE OF COURAGE! Shit! Okay, I take it back, don't wipe that shit! What's going on here? And she has the lower left one. Which, if I'm not mistaken... Is, well, that's the one she took from Zelda, so it's Wisdom. Then, she pulls Ganon into the picture. Or Ganon Yuga, or Yu Ganon, or whatever this is. She says, Yuga, I command you, seize the Triforce of Courage from him! Low rule shall be reborn! And then he shows off his Triforce, which is the top one. Well, okay, they don't show that. Alright, here we go. Ready? Watch this. Yeah, that hurt. Oh, you hurt me too. Yeah, that's right. Guess what? I got one more for you. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Uh, what are we putting in here? What are we putting in here? I don't think it matters, but arrows would be good. And... I don't know, fire rod. So I've used the fire rod way too much in this place. Right I rely on it way too heavily. Holy crap, he's uh, a little bit of range on that thing, doesn't he? He's already flashing red. Ow. Oh my gosh. Yeah, pretty much with these, you want to stay along the edges of the room. Because they seem to have a hard time hitting you when you're there. So, otherwise, though, I don't know, though. If you want to get a good shot on him, 
to stay back towards the middle, so that way... Shoot. Yeah, I can see where you're going. Holy crap, he's doing the Zelda Link to the Past attack. Gotta love that attack. Oh, I should've seen that one coming. Ooh, wow, that really hurts. Good thing I got that red mail, huh? I did bring a blue potion just in case. But, um... Ah, whatever, he's dead. <laughs> Thanks mostly to those purple potions. I just wanted to see how much they would actually do. Give me your Triforce of Power, Yuga. We mustn't be defeated. If we are low rule, we'll be lost forever. Crap. Come now, obey me. Give it to me at once. <laughs> What's going on? My dear, sweet, deluded Hilda. What care have I to save your crumbling kingdom? It's no better than that hideous Hyrule. When the Triforce is mine, I plan to remake Low Rule in my image. Now you, my dark beauty, must serve your purpose. Shit. Ah. Uh, well, there she goes. I can hardly decide which of my princess portraits is prettier. But I do know which of you foolish royal girls has what I need, and now it will be mine. I guess he's gonna wife that shit now. Crap. Now he's got two of them. It's two on one, man, that's no fair. I love this, this effect right here, see? It's showing you which ones he has. It's they never really, you know, elaborated on that in the previous games. They always just showed the symbol and it was all three of them. They never really told you, like, which one was which before. So I like that they do that in this game and see mine is the Triforce of Courage. So, I think that's cool. Now I'll be taking that last piece of the Triforce from you, worm. How far you've wriggled, but at last you know your true destiny to give me what's mine. Shut up! Anyway. <laughs> this is like the ultimate comeback. Oh! Tennis time, here we go. Shite. I suck. I actually suck at this tennis. As you can see, I clearly do. I mean, he starts out slow, he gets faster and faster. I think you're almost better off just spamming your sword, actually. You have it practically perpetually in front of you. So he's gonna go into the wall and say, oh, what the hell do I do? But then Zelda somehow... Hear me, Link. It is I, Princess Zelda. Your current weapons will be useless while Yuga is a painting. So I'll bestow upon you, my hero, one more gift. Gee, I wonder what it's gonna be. Oh! You got the bow of light. It's like... Is evil. You can use it only when you're painting. That's convenient. Oh, I have to equip it. Like, as a separate item from the bow and arrow. Jeez, okay. May my aim be true. Well, it's in two dimensions. There's not a whole lot of ways that I could miss. But here it is. Alright. So go to the wall and shoot him, but then it's like, what? No, he's gonna block it. So get over here behind him, and bam. They actually were pretty clever about this. They have a number of different gimmicks with the air. Oh, shit. I'm not. I thought that was still the cutscene. My bad. So, oh, blah, 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 blah. so we can actually get in the wall and just avoid these. Or we could come out of the wall too early and get hit by more of them. That's fine. I don't know. Ah! I was trying to get my. Ugh. I can't play tennis with you if I can't get in my own court before you start hitting me in the back with the tennis ball. Shoot. A little too late there, huh? Maybe next time we'll try spamming it, huh? Or we can just do that. Same difference, really. So now they're going to have a little bit of a different game. And you're going to have to figure it out. So, where is he? Aha, there he is. Now he's gonna, whoa, he's gonna charge you like this. 
Oh, that's really kind of, it's kind of the same thing as last time, really. You know, you come out of the wall and then hit him from behind. Whatever you gotta do. <laughs> yeah, we're safe. Plus we got the extra stamina, so that helps too. Yay! Alright. We done? Oh no, he's gonna go crazy now. Now it's definitely time to be spamming. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Ganon. Or you, Ganon, whatever. Whoever the hell you are. So now if you try and get in the wall and shoot him, here's what happens. Nothing. So shoot the other way. Surprise! <laughs> I almost feel bad for the stupid head. Oh man, I meant to shoot him with an arrow. That would have been an epic final shot. Well, I didn't do that. That's okay. Whatever. Hilda, are you alright? I mean, I know you tried to steal my Triforce and all, but... Well, I understand why you did it, you know? No, I don't care about you. I'm gonna go over here and check out my girl. Maybe I should have talked to her. There might have been some dialogue I missed there or something. Shit. <laughs> Too late now. Sorry, Hilda. I'm married. Yay. Oh, no. Cough, cough. So what more can I do? Do you want me to get a divorce? Is that it? So it was you who had me imprisoned in that painting, Princess Hilda. Obviously. Blah, 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 blah. Please, Princess Hilda. No one understands the sacred duty a princess has to her people more than I. But you can't. You can't just go around taking things. You understand nothing. Your kingdom has been under the protection of your Triforce. Yeah. But that's... This isn't over. I must have it. Uh-oh. What? Ravio? What is he doing here? Oh. <laughs> what the fuck, man? Well, he had an alternate Zelda there, and they had to have an alternate Link, too, I guess. Well, funny story there. Your hero and I have gotten to know each other pretty well. But not long ago, I served Princess Hilda here in Low Rule. So, begging your pardon, Princess Zelda, but would you mind if I intervene here? Oh, man. How cool would it have been if we had to fight Ravio? That shit would have been awesome. Maybe they'll still. Do, maybe Ravio will be playable in Smash or some shit, I don't know. It'd be like a Smash side quest. You vanish on me and I'll come crawling back. Why? Because. Forgive me, Your Highness. I'm a coward at heart. There was no way that I had the courage to stand up to you and Yuga. But I was smart enough to go to Hyrule. I knew they'd have a hero who could help me. Another betrayal? This hero has proven useful to me. But you, you wanted him to defeat me. That's right. I cheated on you. I'm sorry, my princess. But it was with the best of intentions. Everything was with the best of intentions. The road to hell is paved with it. I wish the best for our kingdom, but by ruling high rule, you'd bring out the absolute worst in low rule. You'd rather see low rule crumble? Well, no, but... Of course not, but there must be some other way. No. There is no other way. Don't you realize, the reason your noble ancestors destroyed our Triforce was to stop such chaos. That's not what I... Ah, damn it. Look around you. This is exactly what happened with our Triforce. Oh, no. Princess Hilda, I... I wish I had used this voice from the beginning. It's a little better for me, but oh well. Too bad my narrator didn't think of it till just now. 
I just wanted to save you from all this. You, who worried endlessly about the fate of the rule. Please, Princess Hilda, let's do the right thing. Low world may be doomed, but at least our kingdom won't be condemned for stealing their Triforce. It's kind of sad, you know, they have to go back to their shitty-ass ghetto. Have to go back to the hood. You're right. Princess Zelda, I've been led astray, tempted by the power of your Triforce, but I swear... I did it for my people. Nah, uh, I get that. Please, Princess Hilda, there is no need to. No, please. I'm gonna let you finish, but let me finish. You are so fortunate to have a hero like Link. What a badass he is. What courage he has displayed. That alone proves that Hyrule deserves this Triforce. Now I will ensure that you leave this dark kingdom of mine safely, and with your Triforce. Please follow me. I know of a way that you can go home. Wait a second, I got my girl voice back. It must be because I'm good again, yay! Because girls are good. And really they are. Welcome to Low Rule Sacred Realm. Yuga discovered that there was a strange crack in this grim slate. And then he turned it again and had a much bigger crack of his own. Through it we could sense that there was another world beyond ours. A place where the Triforce still existed. <laughs> he and I devised a scheme that imperiled your kingdom. But I alone will set this right. Man. Please now, if you will give me your bracelet, Link. What, so I can't go into the walls anymore? Oh, no, man. But that's... But that was fun. How am I ever gonna sneak around and... and I can't be Majora's Mask anymore? I should be able to use the last of its power to send the both of you home to Hyrule. <laughs> Mm. It's been a pleasure, my friend. I got to meet a real, live, genuine hero. Ha! Who knows? Maybe some of your courage rubbed off on me. So thanks, Link. Thank you, I guess. Good luck rebuilding your kingdom or whatever. Gosh, all the monsters are still gonna be there. It just sucks so much for them, you know? being stuck with that, but, you know, whatever. Can't do much to change it, really. Well, at least he has his birdie friend. Well, at least he's back in low rule now, so he can help, unlike before, where he was in high rule, sleeping in my bed. Man. You just feel so bad for them at this point, you know, it's like, dang it. Ha, ha, ha. Hey, we're back. Yay, we made it. Mm. Sorry, I had to take a drink there. Can you hear me? Please open your eyes, Link. Mm. I'm okay, I'm okay. I can't speak, but I'm okay. Oh, I'm so glad you're alright. I was afraid turning into paper there was gonna kill you. Speaking of which, why don't we have a paper Zelda... We have Paper Mario, we need Paper Zelda. And look, Link. What, is Zelda too good to not be canon? Well, they're giving us Hyrule Warriors now, so maybe... Maybe we are once step closer, I don't know. How wonderful, we're back home. Yay. So happy. You know, I've never seen the Triforce hole. <laughs> You've never seen a hole either, have you? Let's go take a closer look, Link. Oh, wow, I can control... Oh, I'm gonna go this way. Come on, Link the Triforce! No, I wanna, I'm gonna go explore. Come on, Link the Triforce! But... Uh, I got more adventures. Come on, Link the Triforce! But I wanna go see... Stay away from the summoner! Come on, Link the Triforce! Anyway, alright, alright, alright. This is being stupid now. Alright. Let's get married here. How terribly sad for Princess Hilda to be driven to such desperation. Her kingdom was in such a sorry state. 
She and I aren't as different as she thought. I really do understand why she needed our Triforce. Thanks to your heroic efforts, our Triforce and Hyrule itself have been made whole again. There's just one thing left to do, Link. You restore the Triforce, now just reach out and touch it. Whatever your wish, it will be granted. Yet after all that we've seen, do we not share the same wish? I remember exactly what I was thinking the first time I played this game. And I got to this point, I was thinking... Let's make the wish together, Link. You know, I had a wish in mind. But I didn't want to spoil it by saying anything, so I just didn't say anything. And wouldn't you know it... Yeah, I gotta admit, like, the first time I saw that, uh, I might have teared up a little bit. I don't know. I'll leave you to speculate on that. That's okay. And we get the same ending music as Link to the Past. So happy. You just know it. Oh, so... Oh, and I love this ending sequence, too. It's showing all the sages and what they went back to doing! Oh, we're gonna stretch! Because it feels so good to stretch! In series, going back to the same series, with the same name as that Metroid station. Go back to the sanctuary and get hit on by all her boyfriends here. Huh. Osvala, who knows what he's doing. He's probably off making sand castles. That'd be my guess. Nope, he's hanging with Sahas. Oh no, it's that lady. Didn't she? She was the one that was like. Didn't she say something like that she had a crush on him or something? He probably just told her off. That's terrible. Hey, Irene, coming back to learn the, the ways of the world. Oh, what did you do? <laughs> okay. Zora, how about you? Oh, this is so cool. Zora just went back to sit in her pool, man. And you know what? That's what I would do. If I had to be any one of the sages, I'd probably be the Zora sage. It's because what could be better than hanging out in a freaking hot tub all day? Or a pool? I'm mean, sure you could get chemical poisoning, but... Well, <laughs> that's a small price to pay. Mr. Rosso's back at it with the rocks. That would suck. I wouldn't want to be up there. On that hot ass death mountain. And of course, Impa doing her thing, making the rounds at the castle, saying hi to the guards. Getting ready to do some drill instructing, telling them not to fall asleep because they're assholes. And of course, the Triforce itself. What is the Triforce doing? Floating somewhere. Oh, the music guys. Oh, man. I bet there's a ton more songs that they have. And I didn't listen to them all. Maybe I still could. You know, I never actually showed those rupee dungeons, those mini dungeons all throughout the world. I'm wondering if I even want to go back and do that, though, because, like, 
you know, I mean, it seems like I should leave something, you know, for the players to see and not to spoil the entire game. Not that I'm having quandaries about the morality of what I do here or anything, or the lack thereof. But, I mean, you know, the Rupee Dungeons aren't really that fun to watch. They're just puzzles, you know? It's like watching somebody put a jigsaw. Dude, it's Mike! Oh my god, I just glanced over at Better Call Saul on the TV and Mike, the guy who played Mike in Breaking Bad, he's in it. It was probably just a cameo and I just happened to look at the right time. I don't know, I, I never thought that Saul was really that interesting of a character, to be honest. But... <laughs> so maybe that's why I haven't bothered to watch Better Call Saul, I don't know. Yay! They're so happy. Oh, and now she goes to look at the painting and she has a guy with her. You know how they were saying she goes and stares at the painting by herself, wondering, you know, what it must be like to be cuddled? Well, she's she's gonna get those cuddles, let me tell ya. Nintendo is the author of this software for the purpose of copyright. All rights reserved. 2013, Nintendo. 2013. Has it really been that long? This game just came out! How could it have been two years already? How the hell has it been two years already? Oh. Going to put the Master Sword back away. Oh, after so much time together. We have to part ways. Oh. See you again in the next game, Mr. Master Sword. Return these woods to their cloudy, ambiguous estate. Oh, here come the birds. Scare the birds! No, I can't scare the birds. Whatever. This is so cool. The end. Yep, that's the end. Oh my gosh, guys. What do I say? What do I say? It's been a fun LP. It's been a very fun time indeed. But... All good things must come to an end, and so must this LP. And I've said that like at the end of every single freaking LP I do. I'm so dumb, I don't have any... Oh, it's pretty much like I said at the beginning of the video, there's nothing original in this world anymore, so why even bother? Why even bother? I'd rather enjoy this, but I must get to my meal now. Let's get to my supper, my din-din, my, my, my nine lives, this is my uh, fancy feast. So, anyway, but, you got anything to contribute to this? Well, same thing as always, but, it's the same thing as always with you. Anyway, I rather enjoyed this. I enjoyed it a lot. Now I'm probably never going to play this game again. At least not anytime soon. Unless they have some DLC or something for it. Which actually I wouldn't be surprised. I'd like to see DLC for like Final Fantasy VI or something. Couldn't they do that? I mean, it would be so cool. It would be so freaking cool! So who owns the rights to that? Let's find out who they are. I mean, all the stuff that uh, the people have... People make homemade games that are on the level of Final Fantasy VI now. So surely someone with that skill would be able to add something to... I don't know, though. No, no, surely he wouldn't want just any everyday Joe coming in and adding stuff to Final Fantasy VI and then, you know, like, having to get sold exclusively. Actually, that might be, like, the new thing, the new job that people are going to do, that people are going to say, oh, you have no right to do that because it's not your game. Yet, you know, if they can do it and it creates demand, then, you know, people will buy it and there will be no, nothing wrong with it. It's just like how people say, oh, well, pro athletes deserve all the money that they make because they bring in the money, so you know, it's your fault for spending the money, and if they bring that much money in, then they're entitled to it. And I guess they are. You know, but anyway, I'm not going to get on that debate right now, so whatever, because I don't know how I feel about that, to be honest. But anyway... Okay, uh, everything else is just poop. This is done. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you again on... Uh, well, for now, I'm just going to go back to Pokemon and then have some Ace Attorney on the side. But uh, Actually, Ace Attorney will probably be like every day for a while since I have so much of it recorded. I can just throw it all into the scheduled uploader and say, screw it. But aside from that, I'll have Pokemon on the side. And I, don't, I have no idea what else. I mean, I guess the most likely thing is probably like... I don't know, some random 8-bit game like Shovel Knight or Adventure Island. I mean, I don't know. It could be anything. I guess we'll see. Yeah.
Oh, here come the hiccups. All right. See you guys later. I love you. I love you so much. Thank you for sticking with me through this. And I'll see you again real soon. Bye for like the umpteenth time. Yeah! All right, stop that now. See you guys later. Bye.